Hey, what's up? I have something super excited for y'all. This is Dr. Adrian here, pastor of Now You Know Life Church. Want to walk you all to the new location that we're gonna be. Super excited, we talked about that we are getting rid of two o'clock service. Two o'clock service has been good for us for a while, for maybe six months to a year. And now God has opened up a wonderful opportunity for us to be right here in Richmond, only 10 minutes up the road from where we're at. We have a big mountain that we have to climb, and I believe that you all are gonna help us do it. But first, before we talk about the mountain, I wanna show you this place. Come on, let me show you this here. So this will be the lobby area to where people will enter in. Excuse, I know it's kind of dark outside, but we wanna make sure that you can see how it's gonna look at nighttime and daytime. You will see it during the daytime when you come and visit with us, but check this out. This is gonna be a lobby area to where all of the fellowship will be taking place. People will be greeting each other. Our greeters will be here to meet you here at the door. We will have our resources here. We will have coffee here. This is gonna be just a chill hangout spot. One thing I want you to notice, there's no furniture in the place right now. So visually, we're gonna need your help really, really quickly here to help us do something big in this city so that people can walk into a place of excellence. So I want you all to walk with me here. So imagine here, we're gonna have our, now you know, our logo that's gonna be right here on this wall. It's gonna be painted or stencil here. The big globe that means life. You don't have to do life alone. We're gonna have it here. Let me walk y'all down the hallway. Join me here. This is gonna be our children's wing. Our children's wing here. Um, I'll come back and show you all the office area, but this is our children's wing. So when you bring your children here, you can see it already has nursery up here. This is gonna be a place to where the moms can come in here and safely come in and check in your children into the area. Again, notice there's no furniture in the room, so we're gonna need your help to make sure that we can make this place live. We can make sure that we can make this place a great place to where mothers and fathers can come to know that there's a place of security for your families. So we wanna make sure that we can have this for our babies in this area. Come keep walking with excellent. As we're coming to our kids' wing here, where our kids are gonna be, you all can see Dr. Dr. C here and my daughter there here. They're planning out things. They are preparing for how we're gonna have this room structured for our kids during service time. So you all can walk through here with me. Plenty of room here. We're gonna have kids maybe, what are the age groups here? This, this would be K through four room right now for a moment. I know that we're gonna have tons of kids, but this is gonna be the initial room that we start off with starting off. So September 8th, we're gonna be in this building. Come and join with us. Come on, let's walk some more. Let me show you the other area. With me, listen, I'm super excited about this place. This place is already set up for who we are. We've been looking. And the great thing about it is that I haven't even been looking for a place like this. God just landed this right in my lap. I was looking for one location at a, in a whole different area. And so the person who owns this building called me up and said, look, you have to come and see this building. It is already set up for a church. And I said, listen, at first, I really didn't think that it was gonna be as great as this. I brought my wife here and we was like, this is it. So come on, let me show you some more stuff. This is gonna be the uh, sweet areas to where we will have a lot of our host pastors that will come here. We will have this area set up as a greeting room just to fellowship and relax so they can kind of chill out. Uh, again, it's another area back here we will have uh, just kind of set up as a pastor suite. Of course, I'm gonna have coffee and stuff back here. A nice area we're gonna have here just to kind of chill out as an office area. We'll, this would be possibly our green room or a place I'll come to pray and get my mind together before we hit the stage. And I'm gonna show you, not gonna show you the stage from the back area. Keep on walking with me, come on. The opportunity we have is about 7,500 square foot in this building, which is a great size for where we are and where we're going with the amount of people that we have now. I'm looking that eventually we may end up having, end up having to have two services, but look, for right now, 11 o'clock is gonna be service. Where we at now, let me show you this area here. We're gonna have our welcome area here. And you all know our motto, every time we have new guests, new people that come to be a part of who we are, our saying, we always say, welcome home. And so look at this sign here, this is divine. It was already on a wall, it said, welcome home. This is a motto that all of our greeters, all of our ushers, our whole entire team say, welcome home to new guests that are visiting with us today. So we're gonna have, this is gonna be an area to where we have maybe some resources and some things for our guests to come in, some visitor information, some information about the about the church and what we're doing, what we're about, and things we do in the city. So I'm really excited about this area here. Let me keep walking, show with me. So this area here, we're not occupying this area yet. So there's an additional 2,500 square foot that we can occupy, but I know for right now, we're only gonna, we're not gonna despise the times of the small beginning, but I know that God's gonna give us an opportunity to grow into this area. So we're gonna occupy these two sides. So let me show you the opportunity we really have here. This is a whole 
new wing. Hold on, don't leave yet because I want to show you the auditorium. I'm going to wait till last to show you the auditorium. So this is really the kids area that we really want to have completely separate for all the kids. As you can see here, it's already set up preschool, children, restroom area. I'm super excited about this. Let me show you this here. So this would be an area that, that definitely would be for our youth or for our preschool kids that are coming in this room here. Real nice size room that's here. The, um, this would be an opportunity for us to do overnight stays with the kids. They can hang out in this area. I'm thinking about we're going to have PlayStation set up here. We can have the Wii set up. We can have Fortnite games. There are so many different things we can do in this room, but I want you all to really visualize with me as I'm talking about the, the opportunity we're going to have here. This just, this room just fits so well. Come on, let me show you some more. So as we walk out here, you have these are two garages. I believe that the leaders that had this building, man, they were so creative. So what they did, they took this space and created two different rooms, but you can open these garages up here and you can have a whole entire space to where you can have a big room if you want to have the children to have sleepovers or lock-ins. The teens can really come in this area and really kick it, especially our youth. Our youth, they just, they just love each other. So we can utilize this area for our leadership development, for teaching, business meetings, any other things that we can do, we can utilize this space here. Let me show you all another kid's area here. Before I go into this area here, Back here we have more restrooms that's only for the kids. Your kids will be protected. No one else will have access to this area. Only the kids will have access to their own personal bathroom back here. No one will have access. We will have security on lock in this area. But look, I want you to visualize with me. We will not be having this location first when we first come, but I know that God's gonna give us opportunity to grow into this area. This is my heart. I would love to have this area, but we're gonna just take our time and grow into this area. So of course, an the area there for a refrigerator and microwave to be there, but let me show you some more. So we have another children's area here. We wanna make sure that our kids have plenty of room to enjoy, to learn. You all know the foundation of who we are. We believe in teaching the next generation about leadership who they are, what's the purpose, what does God have for our children? And we wanna make sure that we can have a great curriculum for them to learn, an environment for them to learn. But notice, there's no furniture in this area yet. So we're gonna need your help to come with us, to partner with us, so that we can do something great in this city. Come on, let me show you the rest. Now this is what I'm gonna be really excited about. I'm really, really excited about showing this auditorium because it's like, yes, I can already feel the spirit of the Lord in this area. So come on, walk with me. Bless our God for this area here. So this is what I'm really excited about. This is where the worship is going to go. This is where, where people will enter into this room. They will not leave the same. The Holy Spirit will be in this room. Worship will be in this room. Lives will be changed. Families will be reconciled back again. Husbands will turn back to wives. Sons will turn back to fathers. Daughters will turn back to mothers. I'm telling you, this room here would change your life. Let's walk in here. So this is going to be the place to where we have worship. Just do a quick zoom. This is going to be the place where we're going to have worship here. And this room here can hold about 95 people. This is why I'm thinking that we're going to have to go to two services really quickly. So we can hold, there, there are exactly 95 chairs in this theater. This, these chairs in this theater came from the original stage play of the Muffets. And do you remember the Muffet story? These chairs came from the original play from the Muffets. If you don't remember that, listen, go back and study. But these chairs came from there. They were purchased from this area, but this place is gorgeous. It was set up originally as a children's theater, and the lady, she decided to do something else. But I'm telling you, a lot of times people don't understand when they're really sowing something for the kingdom of God. So we're going to teach the kingdom in this place. There are going to be families in here, love in here, worship in this place. I mean, look at it. It is so awesome. It is awesome. It is already set up for us. So we're definitely going to need your help. You can walk with me show you, so I can show them everything that's on this, in this place here. The stage is solid. You all know me. I'm not sure if I'm going to be, be able to teach on the stage, but this place is going to be the place that we're asking you to be a part of what we're doing. And the reason why we're asking you to be a part of what we're doing, because we are turning three years old this upcoming September 8th. Three means, if you look it up, biblically, it means perfection. It means completion. It means that you are closing down one dimension and entering into another dimension. I know that God has allowed us to come into this place because I have been praying for God to give us our own building, our own land. But God gave us this opportunity here. This place, I believe, was already set up 
prophetically for us and we're asking for your help. In order for us to achieve what we're looking to do in this building, we're gonna need all of our partners across the world. We need to take down this mountain of about $10,000. Why do we need $10,000? We, $10, we need $10,000 because we have, to fulfill, we have to make sure that our sound team has everything they need. But my heart really goes to make sure that our children have everything they need. We're gonna need furniture in the loft area. We're gonna need different type of curriculums we need to purchase. We're gonna have to make sure that we have certain things set up in here. We're going to have to have some visual aids set up in here for worship. We're going to have to have projectors and stuff set up. So we are going to be in a place where we can only come in, cut on the AC during the summertime and cut on the heat during the wintertime. No more setting up and breaking down. God has provided for us and we are looking to enjoy this season. So I'm asking all of the new nation, all of our partners, all of my pastor friends, all of my families, everyone, listen, be a part of what we're doing. Listen, whatever you do, for someone else, God would promise to give it back to you. And we have been sowing for years. This is the reason why I believe God has really blessed and allowed us to come to be a part of what we're doing. Let's turn around here so everybody can see the seats here. I want you to see, I want you to envision with me the lives that are gonna be in this chair. I want you to envision with me the families that are gonna enter into this room and they will be at a point to where they are thinking about divorcing, they're thinking about separating. But with the atmosphere of the kingdom, Miracles happen in the atmosphere of the kingdom. Love happens in the atmosphere of the kingdom. Everything happens under the umbrella of the kingdom. When it comes down to prosperity, it happens in the atmosphere of the kingdom. So if you don't feel this in this room, I'm telling you this room is gonna be the room that's gonna change lives. Right here in the middle of Richmond, Texas, we're only 10 minutes away from Katy. I want y'all to be a part of what we're doing. September 8th, 2019, right here in this building at 11 o'clock, I want you to be a part. Do me a favor, do me a huge favor. Share this video with all that you know. Let them know that Now You Know Life Church, we're going to a new level, we're only three years old, and the things that God has blessed us to do within three years is phenomenal. I'm telling you, I have never seen things happen this fast for a church that we have. It's because we have applied the principles and the person of Jesus Christ under the kingdom of God because we believe what the word says and we're going to stand. So look, be a part of what we're doing. Share this video. Share it to the world, all your friends. $10,000 is small. I believe that some of you all right now may have that check you can write now. Be a part of what we're doing. I guarantee we are a church. We have been debt free for a long time and we will continue to be the way. So we're asking for all of our partners. Help us to do what we're planning to do in the city. Be a part of the change. Be a part of the growth. But be a part of the kingdom that's going to take place in the city. Love you all. And as we always say, you are never meant to do life alone. See you all soon. September 8th. Book your tickets. Get your planes. Get the hotel's room. Look, check this out. There's also going to be a link below. The link below is going to tell you how to purchase the things that we need. We're going to set up a link so you can go to Amazon. You can see the items that we need on Amazon. You simply have to click the link and then it's going to allow you to purchase those things and it will ship directly to us. And we'll call you out and say, hey, thank you for sewing this into us. So we're going to have plenty of ways that you can give into this new vision. So listen, be a part, put, be a part of what we're doing and we look forward to seeing you at the top, but we want to see you in this room. 11 o'clock, no more two o'clock swag service, but 11 o'clock will be the service time that we will have here, September 8th for our three year anniversary. See you soon.